So now click scan button. And it will show you the open port here and uh, you see port 80 HTTP open and for port 443 HTTP is, is open and if you go to ports and host and topology over here and you see it's closed port and some other details and after if you want to save all the information uh, just control and s and it will show you do you want to save or not and i already saved before so i said google one just press this double and you will see the information about your saved file like what what is all about you can you can see all information over here so next things i want i would look i'd like to show you is uh, i'd like to do uh, 192.168.144. Asterisk, and I will do this time. I'll do this time as a regular scan and press scan. Uh, as asterisk, which means it it uh, will cycle through one to two hundred fifty five, and uh, we will do regular scan. Now you gonna get output in, in this white white area, and and here we got our hosts, and you can see it's uh, gateways and. Uh, my Windows machine and Ubuntu machines and some other hosts. Regular scan only puts information about uh, you know what MAC address is in stuff like that and is here and and we we, we do get topology. You get the topology. You will get like uh, small clear. Uh, picture is kind of cool because we get uh, like a physical map of how it's network, network laid out and we can move around like uh, th things like that and we can save graphic up here as well just the save, save graphic bottom and name it like something like this and uh, an extension as PDF or PNG. So I'm not going to save this or so cancel this. And you can you can send it your saved file to SOC team to investigate your network if you have uh, any, like uh, any concern to your network. And then we got our also host viewer. Uh, Host viewers like this, and you go to like uh, any host address, go to servers and trace through things like that. Uh, like it's like open port, close port, it will give you like all the information, it's very useful for network ad admins. and also we in here we have a fish eye so like you can you can zoom in like you can zoom out like 
ring cap, making smaller, bigger. There's a bunch of different settings you can play up here. Uh, also, we got uh, map. It will save your scan if you go ahead up uh, intense scan. So I will, I will change this to in, intense scan and uh, scan. And that's pull and uh, always information. This is kind of after you get in an intense scan. Uh, this is intense scan, and if you scroll it over through, if you click on each each host. host and you will get detailed amount of information jumps to specific hosts it's like uh, open port closed port things like that also you can click on ports and topology hosts and it's like uh, open ports and state apps all, all the information you can see down here and services and you can click on http https ssh information net bio ssh microsoft ds and you can see all the information on the right hand side which host and map So Nmap is very really useful for like analyzing your like uh, what what port is open, what port is closed, and you can like uh, more strict policy on your on your network. Like if you if you're very good, or if you're not sure, then you can send your analyze to like. Uh, uh, security operation specialized to investigate your network uh, that's the end of my demo thank you for watching